Do you desire to be in the limelight to get the world's attention? Peace and all blessings to you, my dear friends. We are now on the fifth Sunday in Ordinary Time. This is Sister Mayan Molina of the Daughters of St. Paul for today's Gospel Power. Jesus said to his disciples, You are the salt of the earth, but if salt has lost its taste, how can its saltiness be restored? It is no longer good for anything, but is thrown out and trampled under foot. You are the light of the world. A city built on a hill cannot be hid. No one after lighting a lamp puts it under the bushel basket, but on the lampstand, and it gives light to all in the house. In the same way, let your light shine before others, so that they may see your good works and give glory to your Father in heaven. Many desire and strive to be in the limelight to get the world's attention. But exterior light simply dazzles the eyes. Today's Gospel makes it clear that the only light that illumines the darkness is the one that shines from within a person, a light ignited by one's relationship with God. The Responsorial Psalm identifies such light bearer as the just person, and the first reading from Isaiah interprets the meaning of being just as selflessly engaging in the corporal works of mercy and avoiding whatever would harm one's neighbor. St. Paul in the second reading gives a more specific interpretation of this for Christians. He reflects on his example as a light bearer to the Corinthians by being a Christ bearer whose person and proclamation is fundamentally shaped by Christ in His example of self-sacrificing life. Lord Jesus, shine in our hearts and in our lives and banish the darkness in the world. Amen. <music> 